Good morning, everyone. Guess what today is? It's my birthday. And I got up, and Tony said, you want me to go get you a BLT at Trennis? Well, Trennis is a gas station in our little town here. I'm not eating gas station food on my birthday. That, that'll work the rest of the year, but not on my birthday. I want good food. I mean, it is good food up there, but I want homemade, my homemade. So I'm going to do biscuits and gravy and bacon, and it's going to be good because it's going to be mine. All right, I got the biscuits here. We're going to do them a different way today. I bought some of this right here. It's called Southern Biscuit Mix. It's got little flakes of shortening already in it. Now, Gladys swears by this. So I'm gonna try this today. So I already put a cup in here and about a cup and three fourths. And then y'all know I made that buttermilk yesterday, right? There's that buttermilk. We're gonna give it a stir up here. And then we're gonna put this buttermilk in here. Now I don't know how much it's gonna take. We're just gonna spread this around and see here. Your biscuits, now you don't want to mix them a whole lot. You want to mix them as less as possible. All right. That looks pretty good right there. I might have to add a little bit more. I'm not sure how many I'm going to make. Let's see how many I'm going to make and I'll be right back. All right. That look, amount looked a little... Pretty good, so I'm just gonna flip this out here on the counter. That's where I'm gonna, I'm actually gonna cut them into little biscuits today. So I got me some flour out here on the counter. Might need more flour. It's not sticking to her hands. Just a little bit more flour. I don't want the stick here. All right. Okay, that looks pretty good. I was going to roll them out, but I don't even think we need to roll them out. We just need to find my biscuit cutter. Oh, here it is. All right, now I've done greased uh, my cast iron skillet. So I'm just gonna cut these out about like that. Put them in my skillet. Now I ain't making a whole bunch of them. So we don't want a bunch left over and if they're left over, I might have to, I guess, freeze them. I don't know. Just like that, we're going to cut them out. I'm going to take this dough, probably cut two more out. One, and maybe I'll just make a the one for the middle, is going to be the ugly biscuit. How's that? The big ugly biscuit in the middle. I think that's what old timers used to do. Put the big ugly one in the middle. And there you have it. We're going to stick it in the oven at about 450, 500 degrees. Get them to rise up quick and I'll come back and show you. All right. I just, I baked them eight minutes. Y'all, these are fast. Now look how pretty them are. Look at that big pretty one in the middle. That might be for the birthday girl. Look at them. Whoo. Now they are piping hot because I just took them out. But we're going to try to open one up here because I want y'all to see this pretty biscuit. Oh, loud! there goes the smoke alarm. <laughs> oh, I must have something in the oven burning. That's a smoke alarm. That is funny. Well, anyhow... You know you're a good cook if you set the smoke alarm off. Now look at that. Look at this good biscuit here. 
All right, I'm gonna have to turn the fan on or something in here. But real quick, we're gonna put some of this homemade butter. This is my butter from yesterday, the homemade butter. I'm gonna have to holler over top of that uh, smoke detector. Goodness gracious. Maybe I'll turn this fan on. Whoo, something. All right, here we go. Got the butter on here. Mm. Oh, yeah, now that's good. Homemade biscuits and homemade butter on my birthday. All right, I gotta go open the door and fan this place. <laughs> Talk to y'all later.